What is up guys, Joe Holland here. I am on the world famous Golden Road. Just went through one of my favorite towns on the planet, Millinocket, Maine. And I am heading into Rip Dam Sporting Camps to do some serious ice fishing. This trip's gonna be a little bit different than some of my trips that you've seen in the past because I think I'm gonna have a little bit higher level of comfort than I'm used to. I didn't bring the wood floor, I didn't bring my pop-up tent, didn't bring a lot of that stuff because I'm gonna be staying inside with running water, heat, and indoor plumbing. <laughs> Pretty excited about this trip. We are gonna be targeting several different species of fish on several different bodies of water. First and foremost, we're looking for cusk. As you know, if you've watched my channel, my favorite fish and maybe favorite thing to eat. Ah, partridge is up there too. Rough grouse partridge. But I guess right up there with that would be the cusk, otherwise known as the burbot. We're gonna be targeting some burbots. Hopefully I'll be getting my PB burbot, which is around five pounds now. I guess I never really put a scale on one, but I can tell by looking at one what my biggest one is. There are some big ones up here. We will also be fishing for lake trout, otherwise known as togue here in Maine. And Max, I think, has the togue fever, where he's looking for big togue. I know that from talking to him in the past, he's willing to set up for three or four or five days just for one or two flags, if it's the right ones. Also fishing for splake, which is the GMO of Maine fisheries. Also fishing for native brook trout. And we might even put a little tear down on the salmon. Chizuncook Lake, otherwise pronounced as Uncooked Cheese Lake, has a no limit on salmon under 16 inches. Apparently there's a lot of them in here and they want to try to thin the numbers down so there's no limit on those. I eat a few salmon a year. They're good eating, so maybe I'll keep a couple of those. And Ripagenus Dam, otherwise pronounced as Repogonus Dam or Ripe O Gen Use Dam, first built in the middle 1800s, I think it was 1853 by the logging companies to kind of hold back some water for the log drive so they get these logs down to the mills. Later rebuilt in 1915-1916 by Great Northern Paper Company out of Millinocket, which was one of the largest companies in the world at the time. They built this dam, it's 704 foot long and 92 foot high. It's the largest dam ever built in the world that is completely privately funded and privately owned. When they built that dam, it created Ripogenus Lake, otherwise known as Rip Ripogenus, or Rip for short, Caribou Lake, Moose Pond. I think it backs all the way up into Deer Pond. The dam was used for logging mostly and the log drives to get the logs down to the Great Northern Paper Company mill and even some down into Bangor, down the Penobscot River, in the shadows of Mount Katahdin, otherwise known as Katahdin. Max and his wife recently purchased the Rip Dam Sporting Camps and have done a pile of work on them and they're getting them set up to house sports like myself for ice fishing, moose hunting, deer hunting, partridge hunting, hiking, and just general exploring up here. Perfect location. It's 35 miles, I think, up the, the Golden Road from Millinocket. Now the Golden Road, Rip Dam had a sluice way put in for the logs to go down for the log drives, and they drove logs over the sluice in that dam till about 1971 when they transferred over to this road that I'm on right now, the Golden Road. And then they stopped driving logs down the river and just started bringing them into the mill by truck. As you can see, guys, I'm super excited for this trip. I love, I actually love fishing for all types of fish, as you've seen on my channel. I don't care if it's a little bitty smelt or if it's a giant pike or lake trout. And this trip is a cold water species trip. A lot of native fish, not stocked which I really do prefer. Weather for this trip is up and down. It looks like we're gonna get some decent days, warm up into the 30s during the days, and 
not too brutally cold at night. This morning it was 13 below zero in Jefferson, where I'm from. And it's been a weird winter. We've had uh, like a week or so ago, maybe a couple weeks ago, it was 65 degrees and we've had a couple rain days and look like it might be coming to an end, which I hate. I love ice fishing season. Did you want me to throw that for you? Oh yeah. Uh, you do you want me to throw that? Come here. Can't mask on right there. Come here. What's up, buddy? How's it going? Good. Good to see you. Good to see you. You got your slippers on too. Yeah. <laughs> I got my driving slippers on. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think? I think we're gonna we're gonna kill it. Yeah. That's what I think. We're gonna do a little fishing today. Oh yeah. Nice. Yeah. Good. Good day for it. At least the wind ain't blowing. I know. It looks like we got a good week ahead of yeah. us. Weather was. And tomorrow's supposed to be nice. I yep. think they're on 30. Nice. But uh, Sunday looks a little iffy. Rain. All right. Getting loaded up here, do a little cuskin. Got a new set of 20 inch jack traps. I got the big bob flags on them so they show up pretty good and they're reflective even at night. And the four inch spools, which I like that a lot. You get a lot of line on those. And the nice part about them is they fit pretty well right in my, right in my baby box. You ready to catch some cask? You want me to throw that stick for you? Did you oh, did you want me to throw that stick? What am I supposed to do with this stick? Ready? Go get it. You never know, he's seven years old. <laughs> he is? Yeah. Holy cow, he's like a little puppy. I know. What do you think, bud? What are we gonna do today? I think we're gonna put some nice fish on the ice. All right, That's the nice. plan. Go for a cask? Yes. Beautiful, cask nuggets tonight. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Jack that's been here all year. That's fishing. What's up, bud? What's happening? What do you think? Welcome to the humble abode. Look at this, huh? There is a sofa in here. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. What a shack. Yeah. How big is this thing? Eight by twelve. Perfect. Plenty of room to hang out. Oh yeah. A couple holes in the floor, huh? Yeah. That's a bummer. Yeah, I know. It's gonna be a shame sitting in here jigging. Yeah. <laughs> Sweet. What do you want to do? Well, we might as well rifle out some traps. Okay. That's a pretty terrible view over oh, there, huh? It's awful. I hate looking at that. We're close. Oh, the battery's hitting. Maybe right there. Then come through. I think we got her. <laughs> got him. Got him. No, do you want to keep these guys alive or you want to kill them? Because I got a bucket. Oh, it's a perch. It's a yellow. What's he doing out here? All right, we're on the board. Holy cow, look at the stripes on him. The Canadians count the stripes and they're, they're like a seven striper is good. This guy's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, maybe ten. What's that right there coming in on the bottom? That's a nice cask. There's a ten striper, guys, and he's not even bigger than my hand. Ten stripes, that's crazy. So that might be a school of yellers. Oh, look at him, he's on me. Is he? Look, see? Oh, yeah. Get him. Come on, buddy. Oh, okay, these might be smelts with yellows in on them, eating them. Oh, my God, look at those perch just driving those smelt. I'm on the one right above you, see that? Yeah. He's about to hit. <laughs> see that? Yeah. You can actually see him hit. Feels like another yeller. Might be whitey. Yeller. Yeah, these yellows are just destroying that school of uh, smell. He 
Got him. Little guy. All right, there's a jack smelt. Cool, we'll keep him. But when a cusk comes in, he should show up really big and red. There you go. There's a cusk. That's a cusk? Yep. Nice. You want me to land him or anything? Oh. Is he still in the hole? No. Nope. Oh, there he goes. Look. Do you see him just tear through? Look, look. Yeah. That's him going to the bottom. He just tore through everything. <laughs> oh, look. Look at that screen. You can hardly even see the water column. The trouble is, I don't know what is what on the screen. <laughs> I don't have a clue where my jig is. I don't have a clue, like, which ones are smelt, which ones are purge. I don't There's really just a whole lot of something yeah, down there. I don't really care. I'll catch anything. That feels smelty. That feels smelty. Yep. Oh, jeez. Good. That's a perfect size for bait tomorrow. Yes, it is. All right, guys, you are not watching a rerun. I'm actually still jigging smelt here in Maine. That's a little jack smelt right there. I'm here with Max. We The screen is lit up more than a Christmas tree. If you had this many lights on a Christmas tree, it'd be a fire hazard. <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy there. I think it's smelt eaten baby smelt and yellow perch eaten baby smelt. And every once in a while, we'll watch a cast swim through the bottom. Max had one, I think, pretty close to topside. And it popped off right at the bottom of the hole. So that's a good sign. They are here. Yeah, Holy cow, is that you? Yeah. I'm Joe. <laughs> Hi, Danny. Danny, nice yeah. to meet you. <laughs> what? Look at the size of that dinosaur. Congratulations. Thanks. What a giant. Oh, that's huge. Oh my goodness. Well, this, this is one of the other ones. Just Holy I cow. mean, look how fat it is. Oh my god, you guys are getting me way too excited. Yeah. I gotta go video this flag. Right, go hopefully it's one of those, but I'll be right back. No, I didn't even show you. The well, congratulations on that Sorry. fish. Thank you. That's, oh, yeah, yeah. I mean, if I, got, if I got one half that size, I would freak out. I think Chris yeah, we'll be. Oh, no, no kidding. Yeah, we'll smell. Okay, I with my brother. Yeah. But you guys will, okay. maybe you'll see this video after. Oh. And if I get if I get one half that size, I would freak out. Yeah, we like we kept the first one I had, and I was like, that's a big cusk. And then we caught that one. I'm like, this one looks good now. <laughs> if you eat fish, you have to try those. They are the best right. eating fish. Yeah, I don't I don't eat a lot of fish. We had we gave it away, but. See, Max, you okay. like um, with haddock? It's way better than haddock. Yeah, I've had haddock before. That's not bad. Well, it was nice meeting you. Nice meeting you too. Tell Michaela I said hi. Thank you. Perch are on fire. I'll, I'll catch these all day. <laughs> well, look at it. Wait, what is that? Mummy chub. What is that? Mummy chub. I'm, what? What? What is it? It's a mummy chub. What the heck is a mummy chub? It's, it's a bait. What? <laughs> it's a what? I'm telling you, it's a mummy chub. <laughs> what is a mummy chub? Is it a chub? Yeah, it's a smart. It doesn't look like the chubs I catch. No. In like the Chamberlain chain. Good bait. Is it? Yeah, oh yeah. Oh wait, let me show the viewers. The viewers are going to be like, what's a mummy chub? But some of them are going to be like, you idiot, you don't know what a mummy chub is? So guys, that, that's a mummy chub. It's not like the chubs I usually catch, but it's good bait, so we're going to use it. <laughs> mummy chub. <laughs> I brought the scoop this time. I don't know if it's going to help much or not. Oh yeah, I think she went. Somebody home? I can't tell yet. Oh yeah. Small. Yeah? I can't tell what it is. Maybe it's just a bait. No fight. It's gotta be just be the bait. Or a big mummy chub. <laughs> Gotta be just the bait. Feels like there's a head shake though. I mean, there's no weight to it. Oh, it's a whitey. Look at that. Yeah. White perch. He ate that big jack smelt. 
and I will eat him. That's a white perch, guys. I don't know, is he worth keeping? Yeah, we'll keep him. We'll keep, we'll eat him up. It's off to the side. Somebody's home? Small. Whitey? Wait a minute! <laughs> now is that what you're calling a big one? Yeah, yeah, that's a big one. Look at that. That's trophy size right there. <laughs> Master angler. Yeah. That is actually the smallest I've ever seen in my life. And look at that. He took that sucker. He must have been hungry. That sucker's bigger than him. Got him. Nice, jigging, oh, jigging the jack smell. You got a staving cask, Danny. <laughs> nice one, Danny. Yeah. This giant. That's not even your biggest. No, no, <laughs> it's not. But it's still pretty good. Oh uh, yeah, that'd be my yeah. biggest. That is giant. Wow, it's over 30, I'd have to say, right? Yeah. Oh, that's definitely 30 inches. Oh yeah, that's over six pounds, I'd oh, say. Buddy. <laughs> Did it give you a good fight? Uh, not really. No? Um, it got caught up on the hole a little bit, so yeah. I thought I was going to lose it. And when I pulled it up, I barely had it hooked in the corner of its mouth. Nice. What did it eat? Um, it ate a shiner. Shiner? Yep. A live shiner? Yeah. You guys are doing really well on the live bait. <laughs> yeah, this is the only one we caught so far. But... This, so this has got a measuring device up to 26. So it's, oh yeah, it's 30. Yeah. Beautiful. That's pretty good. Ah, uh, yeah. Congratulations. That's <laughs> really you. good. Yeah. That's phenomenal. Yeah. Nice. Do you want to warm up? No, I'm, I'm good. Okay. I just wanted to come over and well, show you guys. Thank you so much for showing us. Holy He's like God. a huge fan of your videos, and I've only seen one from the other day, so he said that you liked cusks. So I, I was like, go show them. I love cusks. They're yeah. actually my favorite out of everything. Yeah, nice. Yeah. And especially big ones. Yeah. All right. I'll let you guys Thank you guys so good. much. Congratulations. Yeah, no problem. Thank you. Look at that, that's got to be a smell, huh? Swimming around it. Tell you a second. <laughs> I think it is. They circle like a son of a gun, yeah. Decent size, too. These are pretty good jack smelts. Do guys come up and, and catch these smell? Some of the old timers do, but not many. Jeez. Not many people do it anymore. Not many people fish anymore. Oh, man. All right. Semi high flyer. <laughs> it's all perspective. Right? Yeah, if I was shorter, I'd call that a really high flyer. <laughs> yeah. Looks like we got some activity. Nope. Really? Yeah. Something small. This feels like a really small bourbon. It's getting a little bigger, <laughs> but not much. God, he's got enough line out. I know. There we go. I caught up to him. Yeah, I can't tell if it's a burbot. Feels burbity. Yep, burbity. They're getting bigger. Yeah, we're working our way up. We got we got to catch a lot of these to get to, <laughs> to 10 pounds. <laughs> well, look at this. It's got a really cool spot on him. Look at this spot on his back. Uh, right there. Hell oh, yeah. That's cool. Burbity. He ate a big dead smell. And they are pretty in this lake, aren't they? Mm. Just one up. Perfect. Anybody's home? I think I left the scooper back of that hole. Looking good, huh? On fire. Old brown belly. Yeah, he was getting all set up. Yeah. 
Nope, no one has it. Wine, I know that. Oh, I did. I just, I just thought that was a mistake. Right, we're finally catching up now. There's a little bit of weight there. Oh yeah, there's some weight there. Yeah. This ain't no small fry. It ain't big, but he's head shaking at least. Might be fillable. Yeah, this one's got some fillet on him. I think he's not big, but two pounder maybe. Pound and three quarters. Getting bigger, smaller. Oh, we can get a fillet. Oh off. yeah. <laughs> Cask nuggets, yeah. baby! Yeah. Woo! Yes! Man, look at these black spots on them, huh? Yeah. I've never seen that before. No? No, they're they're a little bit different color over here. Cask nuggets. Woo! We are on the board. I'll tell you one thing, they got strong jaws. Is, guys. Weird looking fish, but they taste good. I'm pretty certain the uglier anything is in life, the better it tastes. That looks like dinner to me. It is dinner. Yeah. We're going to be eating good tonight. Got this, got a white perch. I'd say we're living like kings, wouldn't you, bud? Absolutely. Look where we are. I know. Show them you got a stick. Maximus. The man, the myth, the legend himself. Look at this Boston, bird. Boston down here. <laughs> yeah, I know. Right in on you. Yeah. You ready? Look at this bird. Uh -huh. <laughs> I can't believe you're out here. This is great. Oh, yeah. Love it up here. Beautiful. And the finest table fare, swimming the waters in northern Maine. So I just put one in the sled. Did you? Good one. E eater size. Yep. All right. I'd call it a good one. I like this uh, box. I've been watching this all year. You like it? I do, I think. But it's hot. You gotta have big trails in the problem. Like the only person I like. I don't want to see another guy. It's because I'm not. Oh, so look sure. at that! Look at that cuss. That's a big. Hey, come on. He might have been. Oh, look at him turn. What do you mean? He's that big, huge, long red thing. Oh, that's him. Yeah. Dude, I'm all iced up. I can't even get my jig to drop in this ice. That's a staven cast. <laughs> Got him! Yes, Joe, nice. <laughs> Davey, I, 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 tried think, down there steel Davey, I honestly don't think that hole is big enough. I was going to go down steel one. Where's the ladle? It's not, He's not ladle? that big. Is there a ladle? Uh, it's right outside. Thank you. Got him, baby. I got him. I, him. I know you were. <laughs> That's why I jigged it just right. <laughs> he feels all right for a cask. I think I got him jabbed pretty good. Is he good? Oh, that's a pretty good one. Oh, he's not right. a couple, three pounds. Is he coming backwards or you let me know if I can do anything? Is he an eater? Yeah, he's four. He'll eat. He'll eat. Four that's four some cask nuggets right there. Cask nuggets, baby. Jig one oh yeah, you should have seen him on the launch. Oh, he's dragging down there. He snatched. Yeah, Dave was trying to steal him from me. I got called Operation Game Thief. Did you get him on my jig too? No, no, I'm on. You got the phone number for Operation Game Thief. I was gonna call Davey in. <laughs> trying to steal my cask. Nice. It's pretty brutal out here. Yeah, it is. It's real. That's yeah, for sure. it's definitely real. Let me see, I don't know if I brought the scoop or not. No scoop, are you good? Yeah. If you want me to run back, get it, I will. Dang. Fight through it, bud, fight through it. Somebody's home. Yeah? Oh yeah. Good one? You want me to kick that hole? Nah, you ain't back up one. He's tiny. Tiny? Yeah. Another little one. Oh, 
bottom of it. I left my tweezers in there. All right, another little guy. It's downright rude out here. My good friend Trapper Joe, Joe Holland. Hey, what's How up? Are you? My lady good. Shauna. I've heard so much about you. <laughs> well, Come on in. I've seen you on TV. <laughs> <laughs> nice to meet you. You too. What do you, let me check your eyes. Can you see? <laughs> I had my hand holding the guy. What are you doing with a guy? Like, what are you doing with that guy? I don't know. <laughs> he must be blind. I don't know. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I love him. He's something, I'll tell you. He's part of my field public, too, huh? <laughs> I want to see you in my garage. Yeah, that was awesome. Oh, oh, you got a big one looking, Davey. Look, look, look. I'm He's on you. Lift up, lift up, lift up. That's a big one. That's a good one. He did. He just kept freaking going. He didn't even stop. We I'm haven't seen that guy yet. Oh, he turned around. He's not coming back. Now, why? What's the matter with that guy? Hit bottom. Did you see that one, Max? Mm -hmm. That was a good one. Right, right in my face. You got him, Davey. You got him, bud. Reel him in. Oh, he's fighting pretty good. Yeah. Aha! Uh -huh. That a boy! That's oh, that's how you do that. You don't even have to friggin'. Oh, let me know if I gotta clean that hole anymore. We gotta clean that hole a little bit more. Does that need it? I think he's borderline. Nah, I don't think so. Just a little guy. Yeah. Oh, he looked big on that guy. Yeah. Well, he's, what do you figure he is? About six, he's over 16 inches. Yeah. Just about breeding size. Yep. All in the pop pound. I like, one thing boy? I like about these, that was awesome. I like that rod. Yeah, that thing's mint. It's so easy to get out. Get Hold him up for the get camera. The little fella. Yeah, just a little guy. We'll let him go get bigger. They're pretty though when they don't drop in the snow. Yeah, they are. So you know? the, the camel on them <laughs> yeah. is unbelievable. They really are. I love the colors. Right. Nice, good job, bud. Oh, what I, do. Geez, I missed the whole thing. <laughs> Oh, God. Up, buddy? My normal size. Oh, Jeez. man. <laughs> that this is average. That's a yeah. six-year-old six guy. <laughs> Another day in the life. <laughs> what is that? Oh, dude, this is probably... That's this the is best my, one he's got. Yeah, that's my seventh one that size. How was that? One more? <laughs> Heck yeah. That is good. Oh, you're a boy. Oh, <laughs> oh you're a good boy. You're gonna chew them in a 
Matt, you feed this dog. When you get him up towards the hole there, you gotta go over and make sure you stick What do I do? Keep going. <laughs> Is it in the hole? Yeah. Uh, oh, oh it, it won't fit. Wait, wait, don't pull any harder. We gotta make a bigger hole. Oh, no, no, he's coming. No, where's that? Uh, he's coming. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> we're, we're, we're holding right through. <laughs> All right, don't reel anymore. Nice, good job. Like, we, we I did that. <laughs> you did it. You <laughs> got your fish. My first one ever. Is that your first fish? <laughs> yeah, ever. Sean, a nice work. <laughs> That was Good like job. the ideal way to like eat him out of the hole. Stop! I did it! <laughs> the hole froze up. The hole froze up on her. She didn't have any room. I see this thing come flying up. <laughs> it hit the like ceiling. I feel like it would have gone easier if I was like on this side. Nice job, Shauna. All right, you're going to be on YouTube. Yeah, you're famous. <laughs> YouTube. Ooh, gotcha. You got your second one too. Yeah. Sucker. He, he deserved it. Yeah, he did. <laughs> nice. What do you think, Shauna? Good night fishing? So cool. You liking it? <laughs> yeah. Nice, you got your first fish tonight? I did, that was awesome. Give me a good fight? Well, I don't know, I guess so. I've never done it before, so. It was a good fight. We'll call it a good fight. You know, that was the fight of my life, actually. There you that go. was the fight of my life. Um, I like the way you look at it. <laughs> what did that thing weigh, Davey? 5.6. 5.66, so almost six pounds. Yeah. Nice. That's what you're after. Yep, over five and a half. Okay. Beautiful. Five cents. That'll eat pretty good. Loins on, loins on that. Well guys, we are starting to pack up out here. I just picked up my traps. I had three traps out. One didn't have bait. The second had a cusk just sitting there on it. Didn't pull any line out. Just a little guy. And the third just wasn't doing too well. <laughs> yeah, no, no excuses for that third one. Should have had a fish on it. You but know, if it, it was mine, I would have had it. If it was yours, they all would have had a fish on it. <laughs> so we're packing up. We're gonna leave. Shauna and Davey out here, but we're probably gonna take the electronics. Sorry. <laughs> so good, we're all loaded up, quick and easy. And we're gonna head back to the ranch and yeah. get something to eat for dinner. Those cuss might be too frozen for the night, I don't know. Yeah. We'll see. Oh, it's tomorrow. Yeah, that's right. Cool, let's go. Yeah. Good job, buddy. Actually, I didn't count. How many did we have? I got one at the end. So I think we ended up with 13. 13? Yeah. 13 cusk. Pretty awesome day. Pretty awesome afternoon. Yeah, afternoon. I got, I, we didn't get out here until noontime. Yeah, I think it was like 1.32 when we got set up. Yeah? Yeah, I was running a little late today. Sorry about that. <laughs> but I got my biggest cusk ever, and we got two other really nice sized eaters. Yeah? So three. That's a great day. Yeah? Great job. All right, let's get after hey, man. it. Hey, Absolutely. All right. All right. Eating some good burgers tonight. Max, thanks for cooking that up. Yeah. They look pretty good. We got off the lake a little after 10 p.m. Yeah. I had three degrees Fahrenheit in the truck. <laughs> balmy. Yeah, it was balmy. <laughs> balmy with that wind. It's probably close to 11 now, right? Yeah, it's got to be close to 11 now. 11.15. Yep, so we're hitting dinner at 11.15. So we'll see what time we get on the water tomorrow. But tune in tomorrow, guys. Should be a great day. We're going after Lakers. Yeah, we're going after some lake trout nice. tomorrow. Ultra clear water. Yes. Underwater camera. The works. Pan optics, live scope. Okay, we're going to have fun tomorrow, guys. Tune in for that one. Hope you like this episode. We'll look at the camps and stuff maybe tomorrow or one of the days. We'll yeah, get we'll get to it eventually. Yeah, we'll talk about the camps tomorrow too. So tune in for tomorrow's episode. Should be a good one. Thanks for tuning in for the days. <laughs>